crowds arrive in waves. Forget about the traffic coming in. Huh? It's absolutely worth it. This is going to be amazing. And that will that will sustain you while you're sitting there absolutely. in the car. Absolutely. It's going to be the best show. We came from Harrison. We were here in 15 minutes parked. All right, and how about getting home? It's going to be a little bit of traffic. Who cares? Anything for Mick. That'd be Mick Jagger, the Rolling Stones, playing two shows at MetLife Thursday and Monday. Crowds roll in and out on four wheels. Drivers from New Jersey and New York say even with the traffic, driving works for them because the train connections don't work out. Train capacity is nothing compared to the crowds. As many as 80,000 people at a game, the NJ Transit shuttle train can transport about 7,500 people per hour. That's how the band known as Attitude got to the Meadowlands, and that's how they'll get back eventually after a different type of tailgate. Where are you guys from? We're from Morristown, New Jersey, and you know, we're a band that plays basically these outdoor kind of places. We actually took a train. Yeah, her and uh, the getting home part might be something too. You heard about the crowds or something? Yeah, or yeah. It wasn't bad on the way in, but we don't know what kind of crush there is and how many trains there'll be. They had a lot of people working inside the station directing people. Uh, we didn't, like I said, it wasn't that crowded when we came through. So I'll just see when there's a crush. NJ Transit uh, has tried to respond better, uh, especially this year. Uh, as big events are happening here, they're really limited by the design, by rules, uh, by the uh, assignments there at that shuttle track that then goes to Secaucus that then would have to make another connection. They'll be running trains every 10 minutes or so through 1 a.m. here. Buses standing by.